Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Low Magic Age. We know for fight. We're still looking for loot. They're level two. We're level two. We could do this to get more experience because at the moment we're a little bit low on that. And we could use some additional, you know, stuff. Um, the terrain is okay. Let them come to us. Six of them against six of us, that is okay. Maybe we can seal them off here. That would be really good. Ah, crap. They're outflanking us anyway. So we cannot really block them off. However, what we could do to reduce their numbers is make this one frighten and then beat the crap out of him. So you go into defense mode. That is a lot of them, point taken. Can you do a fear on him? Oh yes, you can, beautiful. And you do a fear on him as well, oh crap. Who cares? Ah, uh, it was a five footstep so we're not able to attack them, which is a shame. This guy is nearly dead, so actually we're fighting four against six. Which should be more than okay. Okay, we'll concentrate fire on the target that is easier to be destroyed, which are of course the goblins because they have the weaker armor. <gasps> that was heavy. You keep fighting. We could go against this guy as well, but they're just running away. And following them makes no sense for us. So we will just concentrate on getting them down one by one. Heal! Excellent. Now we'll just wait for the first of them to return. And there he comes. And he even hits. Screw that guy. Good work. I know it's a little bit costly. And it is basically the same thing you could do with s elementals and sorcerers. You could just uh, summon elementals until you're ill and <laughs> let them kill all the people. But um, I think this way is even better. That was stupid. Sixty percent chance, even though we totally outmaneuvered him. Boy, what's wrong with you? Anything useful? Of course not. Are they faster than I am? Seems like they are. Now, why do I do this? Because we need a lot more. Oh, that was dump. Because now they can outmaneuver us. If one of them goes here, they can... Yeah, of course. Damn it. That was no, not my most clever move ever. That, however, was interesting. And we keep missing. 30% chance to hit isn't great. But they don't get any kind of, you know, special attack on us now. Perfect. We outnumber them. And we can now go and surround them. That is, we have 55% chance to hit and still miss more than half of the time. And heaven knows how that works. Because I don't. <gasps> Good thing they didn't concentrate their fire. Heal up. Clerics, I tell you, without clerics you would have a lot more dead people on our hands. Half played. I think that could be useful. What is that? Regenerates. If I give you that armor. 21. Pretty beautiful. Yeah, we could be running around killing even more of them, but 
At the moment, we have other problems to attend to. We have a lot of coin. Tower shields are not useful for us because we cannot use that. However, lockpicks should always be bought. Trade. Because lockpicks are awesome. Um, we could buy better shields. But I only want to spend money on real shields. So magic shields or something like that. Ooh. Useless, but it's loot. And loot is welcome. Six lock pits. Ooh, nice. Far more than I would have expected. Okay. Nothing here. Nothing there. Twenty-five percent. I really need a level up. Diorets, level one. No problemo, sir. We've got new weapons. We've got more punch. Wait a minute, they're level two. And they have 32 hit points. They have more hit points than I have. And I'm the hero in this game, aren't I? Oh boy. And I cannot even bring my full force to bear. Let's try to break formation. Which we did. Although that was not that clever because now he's getting a bonus in movement. Uh, um, in hitting us. Yeah, 55%. That guy didn't even die. But we keep doing our thing, beautiful. We should go into crafting because crafting is new. That was implemented. And if we could buy more of this or build more of this antimantium armor, that would be outstanding. Now that was a waste. We need this magic throwing hammers. Just to give us some range. Ooh, this could be interesting. Come on, come on, wherever you are. And it's nothing. But we have a level up. Beautiful. And we get a feed. We could get more familiar with other weapons, however. Um... Minus two penalty to attack rolls. That's pretty hefty. Improved feint. So we, when we stand, we could use feint. Um, and we have the intelligence for that. We could do power attack. If we hit someone automatically. We could do a learn combat maneuvers. Range combat is not that interesting for us. Spell penetration would be good. Combat casting, of course, would be good. Um, control spells. Improved turning. Extra turning is, of course, useless for us because we're not going to um, do that to anyone. Ah, uh, that's a hard question. I'm I'm happy with our hammers. I don't see any reason to get there. We're not level eight, so we cannot go for all this critical stuff. Um, initiative is interesting. Quick draw is interesting. I think we should go for um, toughness. As crazy as it sounds, because it will give us more life. Oh, we get two feats. That's interesting. <laughs> Um, quick draw, no. Initiative, I'm not that sure. Spell penetration. Overcoming spell resistance. We are casting spells. We're casting whole person and stuff later on. So this might be useful. And plus one isn't that much. Weapon finesse is useless. Combat reflexes. Um, 
is interesting because if the enemy starts to flee, we might be able to attack more than one enemy. Dodge, theoretically, but we don't have the dexterity, sadly. We don't have that. We could... We, can try to do something for our reflex saves because our reflex saves are really bad. Um, or we go this way to get cleave because that could be useful as well. Vital strike, power attack. Target of very low level or stunned, although we are not very good at stunning people. So that's not really helping. Improved defenses. Yeah, we cannot do that. I think we should go for reflex save because that is our... We're good at fortitude. We're good at willpower. Our reflex saves suck. That's really a hard question. We could learn combat maneuvers, bull rush, drag overrun, <laughs> agile maneuvers. We are relatively strong, so we could go for that. But I think in the end, it's combat casting. If we absolutely have to do that, I think that's a good idea. And we learn new spells, which is beautiful. Um. You have more skill points now, right? So we could increase that a little. And we keep the rest of the points. The other should be leveling up as well pretty soon. 35%. Yeah, we really have to do something here. Ooh. Yeah, we're still miserable. Goblin, Impaler, Cutthroats, and Shooters. Oh boy, that's the whole the whole team. Look at the range. Impressive. Okay, we should try to... I would not say outmaneuver them, but try to get rid of them with concentrated attacks as fast as we possibly can. Well, that didn't work, but what we can do is make that vote fearful and he will kill himself. <gasps> Don't you even dare. Ow. Nice try. I fear those guys more than I fear the others. I don't know why, because, well, they're doing... Are they doing more damage? They're doing 1, 2, 4, and he's doing... Well, he's doing more damage, and he's more easily hit. So we should concentrate on him first. But now we've got them where we want them. Except for the fact that they're hitting like insane. Our trick is simple. We try to put them in the position where they cannot move anywhere without getting attacks of opportunity. Which worked. How was he able to do that? Oh, because the others already wasted their attack of opportunity. Hmm. Good point. Good point. But we're getting somewhere. You can do this. We really need this level up so that we can become better at... Um, wow, you're uh, proud of your race, are you? You're a ranged fighter and you go into nearly close combat with me. Ah, crap. Then just hit him. Oh yeah, we're regenerating. Because we've got the equipment. The problem is he can still move out of range by simply making a five-foot step, and a five-foot step does not provoke attack of opportunities, which is bad for us. 
and of course they keep firing on us. We heal up because we don't want any bad things to happen. Aha, you're dead. Ow. I could not I could not even imagine a way fighting not with clerics because I so love this this heal all time thingy. I find that amazing. Ow. And I th still think they're really great at hitting people. That worked. You heal him up. So, well, he can still move here, but now he's in the middle of us. You will go around there and heal our friend. And done. Look at this beauty. That's not our type of weapon, but it is still useful because it will pay for a lot of gold. Ah, oh, crap. Rats, and a lot of them. But we can handle this. How did they hit you so hard? Oh boy. By the way, I find the graphics of the game quite good. I mean, of course, it's not 3D model, whatever, but it, it clearly shows you what you're fighting and it, it's, it's believable. I like it. Ow. Eaten by rats alive, as it seems. They're hitting a lot more often than they should be. And we're doing so little damage, it's unbelievable. Of course they hit again, because why Why shouldn't they? They're fighting 50% and hitting half of... The, well, two times in a row. So much for my armor. But we're getting them. Perfect. Chainmail magic. I like that. Who is without good armor? You are. Welcome to armor 20. It's better to have light armor that is... Um, what is that? Constitution. Beautiful. Because that will mean more hit points. Yeah, not that much, but still okay. I wonder how many more hit points, uh, how many more monsters we have to kill to level up. With the rest of the team. Of course, the character that was in the first fight is leveling up easier. Because she killed some goblins already before the others were able to do anything. Outmaneuver. Ow. Concentrate fire. And of course you hit all the time with 40%. Because why shouldn't you? Down they go. Heal her up. We don't want to take any risks. Remember, our clerics are not replaceable. Because if we get any new clerics, they will be uh, built like the clerics that are built in this game. And that is not the way we want them. Ah, oh, crap. You cannot heal. Haha. <laughs> An adamantine battle axe. While the armor is getting you a bonus if you find adamantine, it's not the same with the weapons, obviously, which is a shame. But 
but we should get a level up with the others as well soon. Disarm. Oh, yes, we disarmed the trap. Who would believe that? So here we are, level up. We know what we take. We take toughness and we take combat casting because we're going to f do that in, in the fights. Excellent. Toughness. You can discuss about toughness. However, um, we take everything that makes our life more lasting. We should go for the um, resistances as well, for the saving throws, I know. Especially um, dexterity, because our dexterity isn't as high as it should be. However, I think that combat casting will also come in handy at some point. Combat casting, yes, thank you. Now about skills. You will need to become better at open locks. You will need to become better at disabled device. Disabled device. You are my search and listen specialist. And you are traps. Okay, we keep the rest of the points because chances are... Ow. Chances are that we learn some crafting as well. And that will cost skill points. Ooh, treasure! Look at that, she become better, she can become better. And the loot sucks. Why do I even bother? I mean, the stuff that we find is so bad. That's not even worth our time. Come on, I want first blood. That might not be a clever move because while we... Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. I've got a brilliant idea. Ah, and we miss. Okay, there's nothing we can do but make you fearful, which means that it will try to run away and then we'll get killed. Beautiful. And that get killed. And we try to concentrate on our fire on the guys that are killed the most easiest. Ow. Nothing we can do. Beautiful. You heal yourself. We don't take any risks whatsoever. Should have fought him normally, though. Okay. A lot of coin. Nothing really useful, but a lot of coin. 13% chance. We should be able to pull this off. Because we've got enough lockpicks. Just by math. Useless. 40% chance. 30% chance. Woohoo! And the armor is working. This is beautiful. This is really beautiful. This adamantine armor is one of the best things we ever found. Because that is really great. We don't overextend our line, so we're not breaking through. Good work. First blood for us, and they're already down a man. We don't want to get flanked or anything, so we're uh, not placing ourselves in the middle. Ow. Okay, I've got a splendid idea. Make this guy here run. He 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 he. He will kill himself. As I mentioned, fear, very, very useful. 
By the way, that even works against higher level targets. Of course, they have their saving throw, but still, this is great. And, oh crap. Good work. Uh, plus one to all saves. That's pretty good. And a better shield. Interesting. You already got a shield. I think you have been neglected. Yes. Why does it work on armor? On attack, damage, and saves. Okay, it does not. It does not mean armor saves. It just means saves. In general. Because armor is not a safe, it's not 40k. And nothing, of course. Because why should we get anything? And the dungeon is even deeper. This is a real dungeon, ladies and gentlemen. This is huge. I wonder if we're able to acquire some really good armor, if we could get the chance to hit down to... Now, 0% will not be, because there will always be the chance of a critical, but maybe we get it to 5% or something. That would be great. Oh, 10%. Very nice. And, of course, they still crit us. Good work. Hmm. They're not they're not backing down. They just keep coming. And finish. Plus two potion. Okay, and the coin is good. The items are useless, but the coin is good. Oh boy, that's a lot of them. <gasps> ow, 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 ow. Start beating the crap out of them. That was stupid. Okay. However crazy that sounds, this terrain is good for us because it's narrow. That means we're, we will be able to bock them in. To make it unable or impossible for them to um, move without getting attacks of opportunity. Although they might be all dead before we acquire that. Ha ha. You're officially done, my friend, because no matter where you move, you die. Perfect. Light armor, it's only masterwork, but it's still coin. It is still coin, and this dungeon is huge. Honestly. But we're getting a lot of stuff out of this. This is beautiful. Uh-oh. Yeah, that might sound crazy, but we have to be careful here because these guys can do a lot of damage if we don't play our cards right and we don't want dead people on our hands. Ha ha ha. Yeah, you're already down. 50% chance to hit and it didn't hit. Insane. He's going in the middle. He is a real hero. Um, that is all useless. However, that might not be. Bronze of plus two to the armor safe. Okay. I like that. How about you equip that? Doesn't work. Why is that? This are braces of armor, plus two armor bonus to armor class. And they're magical. It should work. 
I do not understand. If I give you the gloves, they don't work. Hmm. If anyone got an idea why these are not working, because they should, or does that only um, work if you've got no armor? Basis of armor and ordinary armor do not stack. Okay, so this is something for people that have no armor at all. Monks, but there are no monks in the game yet. Because if there were monks, I would be playing monks. The only thing I like more than clerics is monks. Monks is a beautiful character, uh, beautiful, beautiful class. Do it. Ooh, loot. A flail, magic. Um, main handed weapon can be used in either primary hand. So that is interesting because that means we can theoretically use that weapon with one hand. No, because we're not familiar with flails and flazel hammers are two different types of weapon. Who would believe that? Ugh. Wait a minute, that counts as... Yeah, who cares? And of course, with 25% chance to hit, they hit me anyway. I have no idea how they're doing that. Come on. Get that guy out of my sight. Wonderful. Oh, a heavy sack. Heavy sack sounds awesome. And it's just crafting materials. Well, just, just I think is the wrong word because it could still be great. And that's useless. Come on, 40% chance you can find something. No, but at least we're getting bonus experience. Oh, damn it, I hate those guys. Okay, you are the first priority target of all. However, I cannot really move. And we're hitting like nothing. Maybe we should use magic. Ow. You suck. First down. Concentrate fire. Can you get rid of that guy? Should have attacked this one first. But we're okay. I love the music, by the way. I'm not even sure the music is too loud because it's pretty loud. Yay! A constitution bonus. Yes, please. And another one of those heavy shields, which is interesting. If I give you that, your armor class rises. And if I give you that, your hit points rises. Excelente. The rest is sadly useless. So we can leave this place. And go to Holy Helm. Oh. Or we get engaged by Gobos. Five of them, apparently. We do not move. We let them come. And here they are. Beautiful. Ah, oh, crap. They've got these little guys with them again. With their sneaking damage. Or sneaky damage. Did I mention I need better weapons? 
Now I must be really careful to not get outflanked by those suckers. Okay, here comes the trick. You will frighten that guy. Uh, and we miss. Great. This is bad. Okay, um... This is potentially very bad. This could have gone badly. And they're, they're critting... What? Look at that! What is your crit chance, sir? All due honesty, I suspect full play. Because nobody can hit that often that critical. Ooh, 10 lockpicks, beautiful. Um, you, your armor sucks. Like, boy. Excellent. But now it's 23, which is pretty good. They're not selling anything. And they have very little coin. Only 1,700. The question is, what do we sell them? Or how much do we sell them? They will not be able to pay a lot more, are they? So better not sell them too much. Oh, that was too much already. Okay, um, take that back and trade because we don't want to lose money and we will lose money if we sell them stuff that they cannot pay for then they will simply keep the change Ooh, simple lock and ah well these guys should have good stuff shouldn't they they've got a kurki which is an Indian weapon, if I'm not mistaken. They've got Morning Stars. I love those. And they have Wisdom Enchantment. I buy that as well. I would buy all of those. And we should give that back and that back. And I should sell you all the stuff we're not using, because that will be a lot. Why am I even using all these tools? I've got better tools, because these are masterwork tools. They have 300, 351 million gold coins, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I want the morning stars. Do I want all three? I'm not sure. What in the heavens did I buy? The oh, the Stone of Wisdom is expensive. Okay. Still, I think this is a good deal. Okay. You will get one of the new hammers. And the Stone of Wisdom. Because Wisdom 18... You will get one of the new hammers. You could use one of the new hammers. Oh crap, I don't want that. Um, and we should be pretty cool. Yay, we've got magic weapony. We've got good chances to hit. This is awesome. Yes, yes. Okay, um, blacksmithing. Okay, I want the first two to learn blacksmithing. I want to learn the next two to learn weaponsmithing. I want the last two to learn Weapon smithing, uh, armor smithing. We don't need bow smithing and not craft wondrous item. Would be really good. Good. Um, 
so I say I learned that. Um, wait a minute. Does that say anything about that that skill? Maximum combined users. Okay. I get the point. So one more should learn that. Because it works together. Blacksmithing. Um, weaponsmithing. Armor smithing. And craft wondrous item. We're pushing out a lot of money for skills, I know. And mining, I don't care really. Just learn it. Because maybe that comes useful. Weapon smithing. We don't have the requirements to build anything. But in theory, dark wood, adamant. Okay, this is adamant. Interesting. I think we already have some of those. And why can we not build... Oh, we can build hammers. Oh. Oh, yes. Crafting masterwork items. Ah, I get the point. Okay, very, very interesting. I love that. Is there a way to arrange our stuff? Outer sword? Yes, beautiful. Okay, we'll have to uh, give some skill points to this. So, armor smithing. And we have no skill points left. Miner. Hmm. Blacksmithing, I think, is the creation of the ignits to make that work. Not sure if that even is if that is worth something at all. Okay. Okay, you've got no points left. I get that. You're you're selling what? Iron. But we don't need iron, right? Iron is useless to us. What we need is this adamantium stuff. And you've still got skill points, right? Because that is what it shows. blacksmithing. Okay. So I say we stop it here and see each other next time. Until then, bye.